Hi guys, in this tutorial I'll show you how to create a hard Y shake effect easily in After Effects. If you already own my pack, just apply the basic shake, extend the adjustment layer to 10 frames, and move all the keyframes to match it. This will give you a hard but smooth Y shake. This tutorial is quite different from the ones in the AM Film Shakes pack. If you want to get my shakes pack, check the link in this video's description. I've created 16 advanced shake presets that work buttery smooth and take your edits to the next level. Now let's get started with the tutorial. First create a new adjustment layer. Move 10 frames forward and cut the layer's end right at that point. Make sure your adjustment layer is exactly 10 frames long. Next apply the motion tile effect to it. Scroll to the very end of the adjustment layer, then click the tile center stopwatch to add a keyframe. Don't change anything, we just need a default keyframe at the end. Now scroll to the very beginning of the adjustment layer and press U on your keyboard to reveal the keyframe you just created. To create the shake, grab the anchor on the clip and move it down slightly, not too far from the center, but not too close either. Make sure to hold shift while moving the anchor up or down to keep it perfectly centered. Now scroll two frames forward and move the anchor up. Then go two frames forward again and move the anchor down, but this time keep it closer to the center. Scroll two frames forward again and move the anchor up. Do the same again, but move the anchor down. Nice, we can quickly check the result now. It looks a bit rough, but we can smooth it out easily. Under the motion tile effect, enable mirror edges, then set the output height to 150. Next make sure motion blur is enabled on the adjustment layer, and then apply a directional blur effect to it. At the beginning of the layer, click the blur length stopwatch and set the blurriness to 50. Next scroll to the middle of the layer and set the blurriness back to zero. We're done with the effects. Now copy this shake and apply it to your other clips. Let's check the final result. And we're done. The hard Y shake is ready. Hope you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching and if you enjoyed it, please give it a like.